Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Karen Larson. Big Splash Water Park in Tulsa will soon be run by a new owner. As we first reported last night on 2 News at 10, Safari Joe Estes is buying the popular attraction. Today, 2 Works 2 reporter Joe Hankey learned that changes are already underway and many more are coming. Joe? Well, Karen, regulars tell me they come to Big Splash for the thrill of going down the water slides, which is one place where changes are coming as Safari Joe is making a big splash of his own. Starting with the name Big Splash, come next season, Tulsa will be home to a newly renovated water park. I do have a name for it, but I'm not ready to say it yet. All right. <laughs> but it's really neat, and you guys are really going to like it. For Joe Estes, or Safari Joe as he prefers, his goal is to make this water park a little bit more wild. My main passion is animals, and I've got an, anim an animal refuge in Adair. And it's not, and I'm trying to just get people more aware of what I do. Hello. With a newly installed bird exhibit on display, plus a couple of turtles and more animals on the way, the park's number one target audience is on board with the early changes. I really like the turtles because I love turtles. So I like animals and I like the parks too because they're really cool. It's zoo and then a water park put together. Awesome. Palm trees are part of the new tropical paradise theme. Fencing limits the bar area to adults only now and poolside fresh carpet and 200 more chairs are laid out. Now when the park closes for the season in September, the big changes start with the popular silver bullet slide. We're going to take down the old one and we're going to take down the wood structure underneath it and put a steel structure up and make it just, just a new improved version of the silver bullet. The new slides will feature excitement and local sponsors. Safari Joe will soon reveal, he says. But he did share today these two slides will be replaced with three. Yeah, shorter lines, more excitement, more thrill. The, the kids are going to love them. And as everyone leaves the park, they can now drop their change in to feed the animals and plan on seeing many other changes in the spring. So Safari Joe tells me he's simply counting down the days until the end of this season and then the big changes will begin. Until then, his crews will continue with a lot of smaller renovations behind the scenes and also throughout the park. Reporting live in Midtown, Joe Henke, two works for you.